you get to you get to a point where you feel like okay I know a lot mm -hmm. right but I still don't know everything right and so I think some of the difference between continued sustained success versus that person that the people which, which we all know who get there and they have a moment or a chapter of greatness yeah right like at a certain point like do you are you willing to shut the hell up and listen? Are you willing to like be it's the humble? Thing to do sometimes. Yeah, are you willing to criticize yourself or take criticism? Are you willing to keep that ego, keep that line like I know I'm good as hell yeah. at what I do, right. right? In whatever field that I decide to touch. I, I feel confident and supremely confident in that and I don't I don't shy away from that. But I don't have to walk in a room and, and like let everybody else know it, right? right? I'll let the work speak for itself, right? Yep. Like that confidence comes from me spending hours and hours and hours and hours and then more hours training and researching before and outworking you test. before the test, right? Mm. And also meeting people and listening to people and being smart enough to know when to shut up, mm -hmm. when to listen. And then not shut up in a disrespectful way. It's just like, you don't know everything. Sometimes you got to just shut up and listen. Yeah. And we had one of my favorite coaches ever, Coach Jim Caldwell, used to always say the difference between... Uh, uh, a smart man is one who learns from his own mistakes. A wise man is one who learns from the mistakes of others.